I'm Andrew Hyatt. I'm going to be talking about EKG, which is the Emacs knowledge graph, uh, just a, a way of um, it is the Emacs. It is an, a note-taking app, a particular kind of note-taking application for Emacs. Um, it's very. Uh, I'm going to give you a small demo from a. I've kind of created a small demo database here, and. I'd like to kind of show you basically the there's going to be a short video the I have m other much longer videos explaining in great detail the philosophies and the, you know all sorts of things but this is just going to be the very basics of EKG. So EKG is very tag focused. You can see right now I have a database and I'm showing you the tag demo. It has one note in it. Okay? Um, let's create a note. So this would be EKG capture. And you could see, first of all, you could see that it comes with a tag already. This tag is the today's date. And this is because, like, you know, you don't have to set it up this way. It's this is the default. You could change it's very configurable. You could change it. But um, it's kind of useful to kind of organize your stuff both by date and by topic. So you could see what you've done on any date, what notes you've done on any date, as well as um, you know other tags that you care to to put in it. So let's put in, have another demo note. You can see that there is, um, you can, yeah, you can see that there is a um, autocomplete for tags. Okay. And let's write another note. As you saw from the demo note, you can, um, you know, your notes can be in org mode. This, by default, you have a default mode you can also have modes that are um you can have notes that are in other things you can mix and match um, you can have notes that are marked down as well so but let's continue in org mode just to keep things simpler so this is a somewhat normal org mode buffer next we could do you know ordinary things you know like make a you know, make a table, whatever. And all good. Okay, so when you're done, you just press Control C, Control C to save. Okay, and now you can see that we've just, it just kind of automatically refreshes this. And you can press N and P to go up and down, press O to open. And so here you are back in your buffer. There's a few ways to see this. Um, so you could say show, there's a bunch of show notes things. So show notes for today. It's just, I've done all this demo work today. So everything in my database is from today. Show notes with tag. Show notes, latest modified. So many ways to see your notes in various, um, you know, depending on, on what you want. And from here, you can press D to delete. Um, you could you could press C to create. If, you, if you're in a tag node, it'll just add the tags that you're already kind of viewing automatically. You could view notes that have any any of a list of tags. You could view notes that have all of a list of tags. Um, it's pretty flexible. Uh, so that's basically how it works. I just want to, one important thing about to know about this, which is very unusual for Emacs, is that this is all stored only in a database. Everything, including the text, is in a database. And if you look, it's going to be, um, no, I have, uh, well, let's, look at where this actually is. Oh, no, no, that's not right. Uh, set up. Yeah, so you can see that this is being stored right now in EMAC EKG demo DB just because this is not the normal place. It's normally in this thing called triples DB. And triples DB is just sort of, that's the name we put it in. By default, it's 
kind of, uh, it's probably too long for this video to explain why we call it triples DB. Um, so you can see my, my actual thing is, is quite a bit, quite a bit large, it's quite a bit larger. Everything is in the database though. So, um, all it's all backed up and, um, the same as your files we do, you know, we do take care to by default back it up every day that you've, uh, when you add a node, if it, you haven't backed up that today, it'll back it up. So, uh, it is unusual, but it also is very fast and very flexible. I just want to demonstrate one other thing before we go is that you can, this is why, why kind of the database is a good thing. So let's just say demo, let's call it demo, uh, demonstration would be a little bit more formal. So now there's nothing in demo show notes with tag demonstration. Okay. And it's all, it's all done. So you can see like stuff like this is super easy in a database, um, which is why one of the reasons why it is in a database. All right. Thank you for your time. I, I hope you've learned some, uh, you know, I hope you've gotten something out of this. I'm happy to answer any questions. Um, also there's, uh, I'll send uh, below, there'll be a link to the project and, uh, you could also, also open up discussion issues in the discussion section there in GitHub. Thank you very much.